I'm using a snap-on tool here. This is something I've had for decades. There's lots of cool tools out there you can use for your car. I like one with an advance on it. It allows me to know exactly how many degrees off I am. I can just adjust the, the timing mark. Some of them have a little dial on it. Um, I'm sure all the modern ones are push button now, electronic, but it just allows you to make some adjustments to when that timing light flashes a degree at a time. So I, if I wanna see if I've got three degrees off, I can just set that thing down a few clicks and I'll know exactly where I'm at. Another thing that'll happen, this Honda has a couple of marks on it. This has a top dead center mark, and it also has an ignition timing mark at 16 degrees. You're not gonna see that on necessarily every car. Some cars may only show you zero. Some will show you the entire window. They'll go from maybe zero to 20 with some graduated marks on the crankshaft. But a lot of times on an older car, especially those are really hard to see. You might only put a paint mark at zero and then maybe use your advanced timing light with the advanced feature on it in order just to set it to zero and then set your timing light to 16 degrees or 10 degrees or wherever you might wanna to, want to set that. So it's just a nice feature to have on your timing light, uh, especially if you're working on multiple cars. You never know what you're up against out here in the real world, in the field. We see all kinds of stuff.